How's it going guys? Michael here from HomeTheaterLife.com and today I'm reviewing the Chewy Highbox Hero. Now this is a compact Windows 10 mini PC powered by Intel's quad-core Z8350 processor. It also has 4GB of RAM and 64GB of onboard storage. But is it worth it? Stay tuned to find out. Inside the box you'll get the Chewy Highbox Hero mini PC, a power adapter, wireless air mouse, HDMI cable, a mounting bracket, and an English user manual. The Chewy Highbox Hero features an elegant design that's unique yet familiar. Its black case features rounded edges and unique concave sides whilst remaining close to the standard design of most mini PCs. Interestingly, the ports are located at the front and the right of the unit. The front panel features the SD card slot, two USB 2 ports, and the power button. On the right side, we've got DC in, a USB 3 port, HDMI out, Ethernet, and a 3.5mm headphone jack. I'm glad to see Chewy included front-mounted USB ports for easy access. However, its side-mounted HDMI port is unusual, and it's a little awkward in a home theater PC setup unless you have an angled HDMI adapter. That said, this layout is perfect for mounting to the back of your monitor using the included Visa mount for a really tidy setup. I was pleasantly surprised to see that Chewy included a wireless air mouse inside the box. It works in both Windows and Android, though the lack of a right-click button does limit Windows use outside of apps like Kodi and Netflix. The Chewy High Box runs both Windows 10 and Android 5.1, and the box does a great job of handling both operating systems. Windows 10 is the same operating system you know and love. It was a fresh install, and after the brief setup wizard, it activated without any issue. You can jump into Android via the boot menu or via the Switch Now app inside Windows. Android is essentially stock with few customizations. You can install apps via the Google Play Store, and Chewy have added a shortcut for switching to Windows 10, as well as an app for updating Android. However, if you're planning on using Android, I definitely recommend installing a TV-friendly launcher for a much better user experience. In terms of media playback, I only tested Kodi 17.1 under Windows 10, as Microsoft's operating system offers superior Kodi support compared to Android. Now, whether I was streaming 4K videos over Wi-Fi or playing videos from a USB drive, the Chewy Highbox Hero performed well. Most videos play back flawlessly, and the more powerful chipset allows for software decoding of many video samples that trip up Android boxes that I've tested. Automatic frame rate switching worked flawlessly under Windows for smooth playback of all videos. Dolby Digital 5.1 pass-through via HDMI also worked flawlessly, and Netflix fans will be pleased to know that Full HD streaming works fine via Netflix's Windows 10 app. For more detailed info on my video playback tests, check out my written review. So, gaming performance was decent thanks to the Z8350's improved GPU. Beach Buggy Racing and Jetpack Joyride were flawless, though Asphalt 8 did show sub 30 frames per second when maxed out. Of course, lowering the settings did improve things dramatically. If you're looking for a cheap Windows PC for basic web browsing or using as a home theater PC, the Chewy Highbox Hero is a great choice. Whilst I did find that the port layout was a little awkward, the ratio of price versus performance is solid, and the flexibility of having both Android and Windows is a massive plus. If you want to check it out, I've put product links in the video description, and don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. So what did you think of the Chewy Highbox Hero? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on social media, I've put the links in the description. That's it for this video, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one.